passed. And the last amendment from Councillor Cordova. Oh, sorry. Good first. try. Oh, those first two were one. Yes, sorry. Yep, Both. so now there's the next one underneath opportunities is to insert a new section called biodiversity offset revenue opportunities. Uh, which reads, there may be an opportunity to increase revenue for the Kingborough Environmental Fund by reviewing the biodiversity policy against alternative tree valuation frameworks such as the City of Melbourne tree valuation method. Second by Councillor Bastone. Variety's the spice of life. Thanks, Thanks man. Over. That's kind of you and very kind of Councillor Bastone. Really appreciate it. Uh, this is, going to Councillor Street's point from the previous thing, this is exactly a revenue method. So what I'm talking about here is right now we get $250 per conservation, high conservation value tree and $500 per very high conservation value tree. It's not benchmarked against CPI. It doesn't go up every year um, like every other fee and charge. Whereas meanwhile, in the City of Melbourne, as an example, they value their trees in a much more appropriate way and as a result, from their subdivisions and their developments, they're getting inordinate amounts of revenue and it's changing the face of many a suburb in Melbourne. So we should be exploring this. It's an enormous opportunity. Uh, we've already got $700,000 in the environmental fund and that could be $7 million if we would just review our tree valuation tool. Thanks. Um, look, I um, have a bit more sympathy for this than Councillor Street and Councillor Grace in that um, I think Council, well, Councillor Cordova's made a good point in that the whilst our other charges go up with CPI that I think you mentioned in a debate another time that, um, that have been stagnant for a long period of time, 10 years or so. Um, but he, in his motion, he doesn't just talk about increasing it. He talks about um, an opportunity for reviewing the way that we do this. And I actually think that would be a good plan to review the way that we do this because I think there's been a lot of occasions where um, a single tree is worth an enormous amount of money um, to a developer and, and given that um, they could provide a greater contribution than a simple 500 bucks. But I do take Councillor Street's point as well, um, but I don't think this is going to force a policy change, it's just saying that there is an opportunity to review it. So I don't think we're being asked to endorse a policy, um, you're, just being, you're just pointing out that given the um, $700,000 that's gone in the biodiversity offset over um, the last 10 years or so, that is actually quite a significant revenue stream. Um, and it could be considered for review. So I'm, I'm not not offended either way, but I think it's a, it's a, it is a relevant opportunity for revenue. Uh, are there any other contributions? No, oh, Councillor Cordova, over some up. I thank you, uh, thank you, Mayor, and you said it exactly right that this is an enormous uh, it's an enormous opportunity. It's another lever. You know, if the general rates are one lever, we keep sticking it to the to the ratepayers of this community, and yet there's been time and time again. Uh, this enormous pool of of revenue that's waiting to be looked at, and it's a long term, uh, it's a long term vehicle for revenue. And if you're not going to put it here, where else does it go? So um, it's an, it would be an enormous missed opportunity to not name up changes to the biodiversity policy here. It's an area we should be exploring. Okay, uh, so the motion, uh, the amendment was moved by Councillor Cordova, seconded by Councillor Bastone, and it relates to uh, developer contributions called the biodiversity offset and talks about it being added as an opportunity in the long-term financial plan. All those in favour please say aye. Those against? We'll have a vision. All those in favour please raise your hand. Councillors Bastone, Reet, Cordover, Midgley and Winter. Those against? Councillor Grace, Street, Westwood. Councillor Fox, I didn't pick you up as a vote. Was. Sorry? All right, I'm going to start again. All those in favour, please raise your hand. Councillor Bastone, Reet, Fox, Cordover, Mitchell in Winter, and those against is Councillors Grace, Street, Westwood and Wass. The amendment is carried. Next amendment from Councillor Cordover. Thanks, Mayor. 